Corner to Corner podcast on this very chilly Monday morning. Uh, really I'm Jeff. Uh, it is really cold, isn't it? Really I, cold. <laughs> Freezing. I uh, wasn't expecting it to turn this cold this quickly, um, but this mm. is what autumn should be like, so uh, it's, it's about time, really. Uh, I'm Jeff. This is Paul. How are you this morning? Cold. Okay, very really good. Cold. <laughs> No, I'm okay. I'm good. I'm very excited, Jeff, although slightly disappointed, um, as our listeners will no doubt find why very quickly. Well, there's always the uh, option of the post, you see, so, uh, you know, don't be disappointed. I live in the sticks. The post takes forever, <laughs> doesn't it? <laughs> They've got to get a passport to get through the sheep gate. <laughs> I don't want to know what that is. <laughs> So um, we're doing a special uh, episode, mini episode today, because um, as many of you have no doubt seen uh, and are aware, the Magic the Gathering card set uh, with the Doctor Who um, uh, partnership released on Friday. Uh, So we've been seeing lots of people's photos over the weekend of their, their, their sets of the cards and, you know, the games they've been playing and things like that. And um, we reached out to Wizards of the Coast uh, a little while ago, who are the um, company that produced Magic, uh, to see what was going on with Doctor Who and if we could get involved in any way. Um, And we've been sent, uh, we were sent a set of uh, Mm. cards for one of the games, weren't we, a little while ago? Yes, I have those. Brilliant, March of the Machine. Uh, Mm. So we've been we've been playing that a little bit and. sort of getting getting the hang of it um but they've very very kindly sent us in in a partnership with yrs truly who's their uh, one of their kind of promo partners uh, they sent us a box uh, which is sent jeff a box uh, uh, arrived yes they these were quite limited numbers uh they sent and, jeff a box uh, yeah because i reached <laughs> i was the one who sent the email <laughs> um so we don't know what's <laughs> in here so we're, we're gonna do uh, our first unboxing video jeff's gonna do his first unboxing video yes. So I'm excited. These, these are all the rage on. Uh, apparently on, so. On YouTube. Yeah. So I'm going to take my scissors to this box. Jeff takes his trusty scissors and applies it to the brown tape along the corners of the massive box. I'm opening up the uh, flaps of the box. Jeff opens the flaps of the box. He looks this surprised. Is, this is one that will not work on audio only. No, I'm trying to do my best, mate. <laughs> trying to provide some kind of commentary. Oh. Jeff tips the box upside down and produces a large black inner box. Oh, oh, it's got some blue. Looks uh, very exciting. So, so oh, that looks a, nice. There's a very, That's got very a little, nice box with a, like, um, a cartoony gold-looking TARDIS on it. I think that's like nice. a symbol or an icon. The, the TARDIS reduced to yes. a gold embossed icon. Is it embossed? It looks embossed. It, it's um. It's textured on there. If textured. I, uh, in, in the, it's that looks not nice. printed on the box. It's, it's that's quite there. a big box as well. What's that? That's, that's, a, that's a few centimetres, isn't it? That's a couple of feet, that is. I'm just going to um, make my screen bigger so I can see what I'm showing you all. Yeah. So, as, you know, if you compare it to my head, you see. I don't know, mate. You've got quite a big head. So, that must, two of my must heads. be massive. <laughs> <laughs> that, so, that's um, actually rather big. It is really. Compared to. So this is the Rise of the Machines box, which yeah. I've got compared to my head. My head is obviously yeah. much smaller than Jeff. It is so smaller, this yeah. is this is quite tiny. So, so that looks impressive, uh, mate. But this this is a what they've called a gift box. So is it, is that a promo box that they sent to yes, promo people? It is. So, I'm so that might not necessarily it. be what you get at retail, right? No. <gasps> Oh, Jeff's opened so, the box and revealed lots of delightful lushness inside. So I'm going to go through all that. In a minute, we've got a card here that mm. says, "This box comes to you from beyond time and space, beyond through the magic, space. through the magic, the gathering multiverse, to bring you a whole host of exciting new crossover cards." Thank you so much for coming with us on this intergalactic journey. Whether you're a fresh face or an old hand, mm. included in your box is a whole host of goodies that will help you Ooh. in the battles to come. And if you'd like one, a sweet treat or two. You I'll got send, sweets as well. I'll send you some. I don't believe this. <laughs> um, I think people need to realise this is very much a double act. What Jeff gets, I should also get. Well, you, you, should, you should do. I'm going to well, send yeah. emails from now on. Uh, <laughs> no matter when, when or where you are, we hope you enjoy this set. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy it too, Jeff. Okay, so there's a couple of little bits there that we need to put on. This is this is why um, you need you need to have done that in in cinema trailer voice. Yeah. Well, Again, another I'll reason why these should in, come uh, to me. 
in post, yeah? <laughs> I'm fine. I'm not jealous at all. I'm so, in no way. In here. Oh, Jeff's taking more stuff out of the box. Oh, what's that? The, the 13th the Doctor. The magic. The 13th Doctor. Come one. on, oh, that set. looks good. The, I'm going to make your screen bigger so I can see what you've got, okay. it, because it's reduced the screen size. The oh. I must say, the art they've got on all the magic cards is it's excellent. Lovely. But it, it it's is really, really nice. nice. Like If you haven't seen these already. Oh, look at that, man. That's the, the Universe is Beyond 13th Doctor uh, Commander deck. It also yeah. contains Doctors 12 and 13. Picture so of Yaz and the 13th Doctor on the cover. There's, and there's four stuff on the back. sets in the range. Uh, wow. Which have different Doctors to them. Brilliant. So there's mm. that. And then we've also got... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mix this up. Some 3D glasses. 3D glasses, a la the 10th Doctor. Oh, that's for why. Oh, maybe some of the images are 3D, are they? Or not? Well, some of the cards are shiny ones. Yeah. Um, but I, I think for an unboxing 3D. video. Is that sweet? You've got Jelly Babies. Jelly Babies. I love Jelly Babies. <laughs> Fourth Doctor. Uh, and then <clears throat> so there's something here for you, Paul. Thanks, mate. Ooh, that's a the commander deck for the Doctor's five... No, the Doctor's greatest villains. The, the Masters baddies, of Evil. Baddies series. That's got so, a picture of Missy and Daleks yeah, and the Cyberman on the cover. Mm. And the, the, the very nice, shiny card there has got Davros on, can you see? Oh, yeah, we can see that. Look at that, cool. Davros. And there's some info on the back. Stuff on the back. They're nice-looking packs. They, they are really nice, yeah, I must say. I think yeah. each one of those is probably about, what, between sort of 40, 50 quid? Uh, they are, I think, yeah, about that. Yeah. They, yeah. yeah. Uh, so there's also... Might as well be your hmm. birthday. Uh, well, it is my birthday soon, so, you know, it's come early. <laughs> uh, some dry erase playing cards, which I think might go with the psychic oh, paper. Look holder, at that little psychic paper which is wallet quite, thing. quite cool. <laughs> That's pretty good. And there's one of those. Is that, little, is that use, for use in the game then, or, or what uh, is that? No, I think it might just be just a be a little, little extra, fun. Yeah. a little bit of fun, <clears throat> so psychic paper cool. fun. And then there's two packs of booster cards. Yeah, so very, very much needed. The um, booster cards are kind of extras that you can get for the mm. for each each range, um, and they have you know different powers and and different uh, you know. Uh, characters and stuff within there they kind of so get you started don't they yeah, that's yeah cool. and they give can give you a bit of a help not so much an advantage your set. But, mm. so maybe in a minute I'll open one of those and I'll set this one aside for you oh thanks uh, mate to, to go there and then we've got ooh what's that another box a TARDIS it's like a blue cube blue two piece deck box so this stores, oh ah okay so this stores up to 100 cards so you could sometimes put your cards in because part of the the aim of magic is to make your own kind of personalized mm. deck of of a hundred cards in in this commander mode of the game. So you could put your personalized selection in there to take it into your carry it with you battles. wherever you go, yeah. just in case you come across a magic player, which yeah. you might do because which it is a very popular it game. It is very popular. Apparently, when we got these things here, you know, this set that I've got, I looked into it, and it is a massive massive community online and yeah. offline apparently they, these things are everywhere well many many years ago about 30 years ago when magic sort of first launched i played this with friends in america and did you um, it was quite a big thing you know i was only over there for like three weeks or so but we mm. played it quite regularly and i took a load of the cards home and, and you know played a bit here but then you know as often you do you kind of you know move on from things and stuff but you know i'd always sort of see it popping mm. up you know here and yeah there. same so I, I always in the game that. shops game yeah, workshop or what it, have you. yeah exactly and then when the Doctor Who set was announced, I thought, well, that f you know, I, I was interested anyway because it yeah. was Who, but I thought it'd be nice to kind of try and get back into it because I did enjoy it a lot. Mm. And like you said, it's it's massive. I mean, you know, there's the online app version of it, and then uh, what do they call it? Um, fr uh, Friday Night Magic or something. Like oh yes, yes, yeah. People go to game shops and, and play, mm. or you know, they have yeah. gatherings at their friends' houses. The shop is like closed. That. The room at the back. Is all kind of set up with a yeah. whole sort of Dungeons and Dragons kind of styly. So yeah, they bring out all the props exactly. and everything, don't they? Yeah. Which yeah. I think this is, isn't it? It's kind of like a card, a trading card version of sort of Dungeons and Dragons. It is a little bit, yeah. And like Pokemon and stuff, you know, mm. part of this is you, you can trade cards if you want to. And they, yeah. they sell for quite a lot of money sometimes. You know, yeah, um, apparently some, some quite rare ones and quite yeah, old ones as well, exactly. isn't it? Yeah, exactly. 
Uh, so there's also a, a little box of marshmallows here as well. Oh, you've got loads of treats, haven't you? Sorry, right, I don't like marshmallows. You can keep nice. those. Um, and then... Ooh, this, weird texture, do you know what I mean? Here. Bizarre. What's that, a poster? Tea towel? Uh, it's a, An apron? It's a mat, a gaming mat, I think. Oh, that's very cool. Look at that. Which is very nice. It's, wow. It's, um, rubber. Thick, it's sort of rubbery. It's rubber and a yeah. bottom, so it won't slip, Jeff. Yeah. So that's very cool. It's quite good, that, isn't it? I like that. And then, um, oh, there's, there's uh, what else? three coloured pens Marker for pens. the uh, um, psychic The dry wipe. There, oh. Which is quite cool. So, shall I open one of these? And we'll go on then, please. On yes, go on, let's open it. Let's have a look. I can't wait to see. This is what you do on uh, unboxing videos. You okay. unbox or unwrap. This could be an unwrapping video. Um, and Jeff is struggling, not going to lie. Un he's, um, <laughs> he's having Unable difficulty here. It. Mate, just um, where's, where's my just, just, tear, just tear it down. Just tear it down the top. You're making me stressed just looking oh, at you. God. Oh my god, I can't bear it. I cannot bear the there tension, I've people. I've done it. I've done He's it. Done it. I've done it. It's well done, mate. Right. It's all right. That's amazing. So I'll take it all up, back. You're not useless. Oh, I've got a Cyberman. Cyber dude, artifacts it's creature. Yeah, it's a bit shiny look. Which is oh yeah, cool. it's got a shine on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So and he's then, got oh, some on the other side. It's got Dalek. a Dalek. Very nice. Menace. That's quite a simple um, attribute um, there, isn't it? Yes. Like attribute. It just says menace. Token artifact creature Dalek. Yeah. Ooh. So there are different ways to kind of play these cards, aren't they? They, they have sort of different information on them. Yeah, they do. to how much mana you've got, like magic power. So it'd be interesting to see how all of that stuff relates or fits into the Doctor Who universe, how yeah, they've adapted it to kind of suit that. It's it's the same uh, mechanics, but you know mm. they sort of themed these kind of classic cards in, into Doctor Who stuff. So this, for example, so like you said, the mana. This is a a, a basic land. So you you've got yes. five different lands. You'll play them first, don't you? Yeah. Sort of set your stage. You, you put, so they effectively give you your energy. So you've got mm. like the equivalent of water, fire, earth, uh, death, the elements, um, and, and death, uh, sunlight. Death. Yeah. Death. Uh, so we've got. The Eighth Doctor. Oh, look at that. A legendary yeah. creature. And if you're wondering, these numbers in the corner, the four slash four, that relates to, uh, I think, first is the um, attack uh, strength when you're fighting, and then the second one is is the effectively the energy level. So if you came at me, uh, at my Eighth Doctor, with a card that had slash five. Two by two or something. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah you'd, you'd take it out. So yeah. that's how that works. I would lose. Uh, so there's a... Vashta Narada. Vashta Narada, yes. Yeah, so that's that? a one of one. Yeah. yeah, so that's kind of a good uh, foot soldier type mm. thing. And then this is a... Yeah, because you can sap people's power and strength by just playing those sort of cards, can't yeah. you? You know you're going to lose that card, but you take strength out of your opponent. That's it, yeah. Oh, and so then this you've got is a yep. hand, uh, what's it called? Uh, thought vessel. So this looks like the fob watch. Open oh, to yes. Yeah. And then, obviously, you've got little descriptions now which show you what yes. attributes they, they bring to your deck it says or you to have, your, your play. You have no maximum hand size. So normally you'd, you'd hold seven cards at a time uh, in your hand. You, so with that, you play that, no maximum. Yeah, you, you can have as many, many cards as you, as you want. want. Yeah, So you could, you could store a load of mana and mm. stuff and get, get that ready. Uh, this is a thriving bluff. Uh, enters the Let's have a look at it tapped. then. It looks a bit like um, the uh, city card, on the man. space uh, whale in. Um, oh, the, oh, uh, yes, what, yes, it does. Its name, the second Eleventh uh, Doctor episode of Amy, where they go. You've made me forget it now. The one with the smilers in it. Yeah, that one. <laughs> yeah, what's it called? I've completely forgotten. I'm doing this. <laughs> You're getting as old as uh, me, Jeff. Oh, this is a very. Look at that one. Desolate lighthouse. So that look, looks like that's from the Thirteenth Doctor, isn't it? Yeah. From, um, Draw a card and then discard a card. Is that what it said? Yeah, yeah. And it's got a couple of mana requirements there as well. So hit this one is flatline. Oh, look at that. Creatures your opponents control have base power and toughness until end of turn. It's quite nice as well that they have the little um, uh, little outtakes from little quotes from from the show as well isn't yeah. it you know which kind of again sort of um on the standard magic cards you you get those but they, yes. they're all kind of random like on this one here i got what's that say uh, that, that that sort of thing Can't yeah see that. there we go 
it's down there, and it's just I've, kind of that people have made up. So Very this tried is to bend. What you got there? Fetid, fetid pools. pools. I was going to say something there, but I won't. <laughs> <laughs> This enters the battlefield tapped, so that means when you put a card down, mm. you, you put it that way, and then when you want to action it, you tap it to turn, turn it, it. Mm. so then it's, it's live for play. And then it's in play. That's it, yeah. So then I've got the Pandorica. Oh, yeah. I mean, the artwork, again, as with all these cards, is absolutely oh, lovely, isn't it? Yeah, That's really, really, really good. Nice. Look at that. It's beautiful, that is. I like that. And then, oh, this looks like uh, Midnight, Sunbaked Canyon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. So that's of, um, a, a mana, I think. Yeah, that's a like, yeah a land card. Yeah. Ooh, this one Ooh. looks very shiny. That's Perry. really shiny. Can I let me hold that? There we go. There she is, sitting on yeah. a rock. Nicola Brown kind of there. suggestively. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what she's doing on a rock, but there you go. So Perry's this on a rock. is Temple of Epiphany. Hey, look at that. I really like these the <clears> reflective <throat> stuff. It's really nice. Yeah, they're very nice. They're playing Merry Hell with the camera in mind, but um, yeah, we're just about to see them. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, this is, it might this... be cold, but it's very sunny outside. Yeah. <laughs> this is Growth Spiral. Oh, That's really okay. nice looking. That's very nice. Yeah, look at that. It's got holographic effects, hologramic, Ooh. whatever they call it. Now, I was just going to say... Mm. Um, in the uh, the main sets, there's a, a sort of a card for each Doctor. And then in the booster packs, randomly, there are alternative versions of each of the uh, oh, yes. legendary creatures of the Doctor. Mm. And those cards have a more uh, have a slightly different illustration uh, and style on them as well. So I just have got the ninth Doctor. Oh, oh look at that. Yes. Everybody, Everybody lives. lives. Uh, and also magic hands there. The second oh, that's Doctor lovely. as well. Oh, look at that. It's really Patrick cool. Traun. Yeah. Fabulous. So that's a pretty good uh, booster good set that I got, got there. Yeah, that I was just like... the booster set, wasn't it? That's yeah, not even was, the main yeah. pack. He hasn't yeah. even opened that yet. Shall I, shall I open it? Yeah, as long as, um, I mean, given that you struggled with the with the cellophane yeah. and the wrapping, <laughs> I'm slightly well, concerned as to uh, how this one's going to be done. I'm already uh, not quite sure. Careful. Let's see. I don't want to damage this it. Is, no, this is, no, this is causing me stress already. You can hear that ripping noise. Oh! <laughs> A little bit of uh, ASMR for you there. Uh, look at him. The tension is unbearable as Jeff wrestles with the cardboard box oh, and the very, very sticky glue which they used as an adhesive. I'm in. You're in? Any damage? Uh, no, it's super. Oh, he's efficient. done well. Well done, mate. So, there's a couple of counters there. Cardboard oh, look at that. Counters, Pop those out. Part of the game. Jeff tips just... the box upside down to slide out its contents. Ooh, there's, a, there's an envelope of something. Ooh, a black envelope. Very slim. Uh, Could be the rules, mind you. <laughs> it's it's tightly packed, isn't it? It is, yeah. Something there as just well. Give it, give it a good old shove. Good shake. It's not like there's any glass in there or anything, is there? No. He's struggling. That is really tight. I think. See, now this is the thing because we always want to keep the packaging, don't we? Yeah, especially when it that looks is good. that is really tight. Oh, he's got it. I think there is movement. There is some give. Left to right motion. Gentle rocking as it as he removes there the inner from the carton. Look at that. So, ah. So it's got it's, so this is the main content pack. So there's some more tokens down the side which you use for, for part of it. Mm -hmm. uh, and then you've got these. They're little TARDIS tokens. They've got yeah. little TARDISes on them. And then the ones on, on the side, side, you've got some slightly different stuff. Oh, and they've got some little like, uh, emblems. That one looks like a Star Wars Rebellion album, emblem, the Phoenix. Now, I'm they've not got their sure franchises a bit confused. There we go. Right. So oh, there's what's a that? little pop out box here, which I would imagine is for the cards. Ah, uh, yes, but you have your new blue cube. Yeah, this one is very nice though. Look, it's got Yaz and the Doctor on it. Oh, and, that's uh, lovely. Nirvana. So these sets, I think, are uh, yeah. themed to specific manas. So you can see you've got 
the, the land. So those are your yeah, <coughs> earth, water, nature, and, water, and fire. Yeah. You got there. So that that's kind of what this and black set is your, would your be death one, isn't around. it? Yes. And then here, oh, mm. oh, I've got my cards. Oh, look at that massive pack. Got, How many? What's that? So about? There's a hundred in, in here. Yeah. Mm. So wow, as you can see, quite Learned a to play. large. QR Super. code on the back. And Zap the QR code and be taken to uh, somewhere. Yeah, I guess, I guess. take you to the uh, website. There's a little leaflet here. A little leaflet. That's a that's a that's a poster. That's an A2 <laughs> size poster. That is, is it not? So this is explaining each of these sets have a slightly different kind of mechanic. So this is Paradox mm -hmm. Power. So there's slightly different rules to it. But you can see there you've got Commander rules. Uh, yeah, so it's the back, a different game modes, isn't it? Different ways of playing. Yeah, that's the deck. It. Uh, we got a picture of the Doctor and Yaz there. Uh, Lovely artwork again. A bit of stuff about mana there at the bottom. Ooh. And then there is also... Ooh. Ooh. So in what Magic... What else you got, mate? You, What's that? Ooh. This is the equivalent of your hit counter. Oh! So you, in you, the yeah. March of the Machines, it was a multi-sided dice. Like this. There you go. Yeah. Basically. So you rotate the dice when you get hit, so it counts down mm. from, from 20 points. But in um, in the You've commander got a mode, slider wheel. I like that. Mm. You have 40 points to start with, so it's possible that um, you you would lose if you had all 40 points depleted, or yes. if if your commander, which would be your principal legendary character. So, for example, I could have 13th Doctor be the commander of my deck, which is kind of the intention of this set if that specific card can cause 21 points of damage mm. to its opponent they lose automatically so you've got sort of two ways to win two ways to lose basically two ways uh, to win and two ways to oh. lose oh. So there's a little white box that i thought was just there's a little to... white box is that uh, like a placeholder yes it is but inside it is a oh it's got a thing inside it look at that very What's sparkly that? Dice with the magic oh. logo on, Ooh. And, and a little logo so on the that, back there. What as would well. that be for? Just casting a bit of, uh, throwing some variables into the mix. Uh, maybe it will uh, explain. I'm sure on the uh, in the yeah. leaflet there. So we'll find it out. Might, so. It yes. might. It might explain. It, it might, might confound do. the issue yeah. even further. <laughs> do, and say yeah. the best way to do it is to play it, which I think is actually the best way to well, learn this, isn't it? Just well, oh, also, get on with it. Find someone who knows about it, Ooh. who's played it before, perhaps. So that little brown, uh, little black envelope. Oh yeah, what was in there? He's got another a, another booster a mini, card. Mini set of boosters there, mm -hmm. uh, and some bigger like a... cards. These are plane chase cards. Oh, what? So uh, let's open these quickly and have a look. I won't go through the uh, main set of cards because there's a hundred in there. And that was yeah, we've had a look at the, the booster cards, so haven't we? Go through. This so, is a fantastic package you've got here, mate. This is lovely. So we've got. It's got you can frame those. The Doctor's Child. Would you, would you play Bar. those? Uh, yeah, well, it did say on the poster about Plane Chase, mm. so we'd need to find out how that mechanic works. Oh. So, is that Storm Cage? Storm Cage yeah. Containment, yeah. And the Drum Mining Facility. And what's that? The Singing Towers of Derillium. Oh, oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. And oh, it's a fixed point in time. The Raven. Clara and Clara's the Raven. Pose. Besieged, Besieged Viking, Viking village. village. Interesting. From the, mm. uh, the girl who lived. Who lived, yeah. North, uh, Pole, North Pole Research Pole. Base. Yeah, look, you can see Santa Slay oh, there. Oh, yeah, yeah, there it that is. That must yeah. be from. Um, uh, Go on. Oh, God, I've forgotten that one's name as well. That's <laughs> awful. That Last Christmas. Yeah, the, the the one that I still can't believe went out on Christmas Day because it's so yeah. bloody terrifying. Yeah, but it does feature Santa Claus and some elves. Yeah, so. it, yeah which softens its like The Temple of, of Atropop Atropopopopos. And Kablam. Kablam well. Warehouse. Cool. Interesting. Ooh. One more. Oh, there's another one. The Dining the Car. The Dining Car. Mummy on the Orient Express. Well done, there. mate. Brilliant. Yeah. Oh, so, I love that's those. really nice. They've put uh, some work into these, haven't they? Really they? Have. they always so do, this but this little. looks astonishingly good. This is really, uh -oh. really Let's good. Let's see if Jeff's um, cellophane unwrapping skills have improved since his last effort just 10 minutes ago. It doesn't sound like doesn't it. Like he's not showing us. He's not actually pulling this into no. camera. <laughs> it's too shameful. 
Oh my goodness. No, do you know what? It's better. I've done oh, it. I've done it. I've done my it. heart it's dropped it's through my trousers it. right there when that ripped. <laughs> so there's a little QR code there that you can scan to find very out. Very important. More. Yep. I've got a very nice Davros card. Davros. Yes, yeah. Doctor. I would do it. And with that power, I would set myself up among the gods. It's my Davros. That's not the quote on it, though. No, it wouldn't be, would it? No. Uh, What's a that? Cyber, cyber conversion. Cyber conversion. Yeah. That's cyber cool. conversion. Yeah. Is that better? Realize, is that right? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, the, that's look, good. the little teardrop eyes. Uh, so, oh, yes, so it is. Nice. And yeah. uh, a sort of... Um, Looks a bit Matrixy. y no, it doesn't. It's pre-Matrix, code. mate. Forget that. <laughs> yeah, stop, that is. Stop, yeah. <laughs> stop equating Doctor Who stuff to rip off copies, honestly. <laughs> Doctor Who was first. Yeah, 60 years ago, indeed. Exactly. Yeah, um, it did all of that stuff be yeah. way before any of that. So that's quite... Uh, wow, that's quite that's exciting. That's very exciting, That's yeah. a birthday present and a half yeah. you got there, mate, isn't it? That's, that's very exciting, astonishingly yeah. good. Wow. So, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna pop these in the post for you today. Yeah, uh, I'll get so a you present. Can get those because uh, it's actually my birthday soon. Actually, I've I've got uh, about a month or so to go until it's yeah. until it's mine. Mm. So that's that's be you covered. A year old, I'm be yeah. a year older than I am today. So yes, it's depressing. But that looks astonishing. Yeah. So wow, thank you, the yeah. guys at Magic. And thank you what very was the much. Why uh, RS truly? Why RS truly? Yeah. Thank you so much. That looks astonishing. Yeah. Really, really good. So, beautiful, beautiful deck of cards. We're going to really, get stuck really into this soon, aren't we, and start mm. playing. And uh, a couple of our regular followers have got sets as well, and they're interested. Yeah, in playing, we could so. have a round table session. We could do yeah. something there, couldn't we? Yeah. yeah. I'd have to see yeah. how much um, how much memory storage space, how much like disk space we've got on our cloud for this platform. Yeah. Because <laughs> these, <laughs> these games can go on for yeah. quite some time. Yeah, mm. it might have to be a... Uh, might uh, have to upgrade our plan, Jeff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll look at that, yeah. <laughs> So, brilliant. If you've got uh, any of the magic cards, let us know. Let us you, know. Yes, please. Like send us some to, shots um, as well if you want to yeah. you know, send some little pickies of your favourite cards. That'd yes. be great. Yeah, do. Yeah. And uh, if you fancy a game at some point, let us know. And we'll let us know. Down. Yeah. As long as so, you're not going to beat us, actually. Uh, we yeah, don't want you, people who are too good uh, at this. Because yeah. I am very much a novice. I've literally only just started to figure it out, how yeah. to play it. So Yeah, we need a bit of guidance. And, and then, I don't like losing. So. Yeah, he's, he's quite I'm not a very good loser at all. Yeah, he, he can't. <laughs> he I'm can't still. Lose. I've been trying to deal with it since I was like five years old, and I, I, I'm making progress. I'm, I'm getting there. Just, I'm not there yet. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Sure. Okay. <laughs> brilliant. But lovely. Brilliant. Thank you. Brilliant. Thank um, you very much for this. Yes. This is amazing. Wow. Uh, just astonishing. Yeah. Well done, Jeff. Great unboxing skills Brilliant. there, mate. Thank you. We yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get to another one sometime. Yeah. Thank you, listeners. Brilliant. See right, you again for, for a full episode very soon. soon. Bye for Bye. now. Bye. Bye. Bye.